This is what's now continuing to focus on new reality shows this summer. And one that you don't want to miss is called Caught in the Act Unfaithful. This is a show full of juicy twists and turns and drama. And I spoke with the host recently, Tammy Roman. Let's take a look. Caught in the Act Unfaithful tracks host Tammy Roman as she sets out on a mission to empower suspicious lovers to catch their cheating partners in the act. In fact, once the investigation is complete, the suspicious lover can choose to team up with their partner's other lover or take them both down in an undercover ambush. It's a very exciting show. Tammy, thanks for being here. How are you? <laughs> I'm doing well. Thank you so much for having me. This is a very juicy series, very dramatic with twists and turns. Tell me all about it from your perspective. Listen, this is the best thing that I've ever been involved with from an unscripted standpoint. It, it, it's the closest thing. It's like a talk show, reality show hybrid. <laughs> um, you know, but I get the opportunity to really sit down with, with couples and, and empower people within their relationships. And that is exciting to me. You know, it's not just frivolous entertainment, um, but really just touching people and, and working with them and help helping them navigate through their relationships and be able to make proper decisions about the future. You know, the whole undercover ambush is really a turn that I don't know if we've really seen before. How does that play out on screen? Can you tell us any more about that piece of it? Well, what you end up seeing is a suspicious lover. You know, uh, we do a whole investigative aspect to the show where I send out a private investigator to collect data, information, receipts. <laughs> and uh, once we get that information, we bring the suspicious lover back in. They then look at everything and have the opportunity to say, hey, I want to sit down and talk to this person, or I don't want to talk to them. I just want to go take them both down. Now, what ultimately ends up happening is the suspicious lover confronts the cheater and the, the other lover, right? The other of the person in the dynamic. And sometimes that goes how I would like it to, which is everybody have a conversation, everybody get the answers they need, we get to the truth, we get to the bottom of things, and that suspicious lover is able to make a decision on whether they're going to continue with this person or go on with their life. Other times it goes awry. <laughs> But but I think that's what's special about the show is you never know what the outcome is going to be because there's so many layers to it that each show, each episode has a different ending because we don't know what choices the people are going to make. And that is definitely a, a, an aspect that we haven't seen before. Oh, it's so true. Many layers here. I love what you alluded to before that while there's so much drama and you don't know what's going to happen and their emotions are, of course, very, very high and everything that's happening here, it's empowering someone to be able to have all of the information to be able to make the best decisions. And really, that's at the root of this. Absolutely. And when, uh, you know, I've got some great executive producers in uh LaShawn Browning and Kim McCoy, who are the females behind the show. And that's what we wanted to make sure that we offered the people coming on the show, as well as the audience, the opportunity to be armed with knowledge because knowledge is power. It's, we're, we, you know, when you have a show like this and you deal with relationships and multiple people and infidelity, you're going to have the dramatic effect of everything, right? Because you never know how people are gonna respond to information. What we wanted to make sure that we offered was counsel, was, you know, um, a relationship expert, you know, a therapist after the fact. We want to be able to give people all the elements that they need to be successful after they come off of this show. And whether that is we're going to stay together and try to work it out, we've got a therapist for you, or I don't want to deal with this person, but I need help, you know, processing the information. I just found out we've got a therapist there as well. I mean, we just want to make sure that everybody feels good about their experience and has the opportunity to take their power back to control the narrative of their life. And the projects that you've done leading up to this, you're so well known for being very honest, 
you know, telling people what they need to hear, what we all want to say, but maybe mm-hmm. are, you know, can't say it as well as you can. What is it about your personality that makes you so good at being able to navigate these tough situations? My mother raised me to be authentic, to be my genuine self at all times. And whatever the outcome is, whether it's positive or negative, being able to accept the responsibility of all of my actions. And so I've never felt the need to be anything other than myself because that's just how I was raised. And having that element inside of me that only knows how to be truthful, um, you know, it, it is a blessing, is a blessing to me. I, I'm very thankful that my mother raised me in that way. And, and because of that, because of me always just trying to operate from a space of truth, people respect what I have to say. And that's how I've been able to sustain in this business since 1993 is being authentically and genuinely and unapologetically myself with nuance. You're the ideal individual to be hosting the show Caught in the Act and Faithful premieres Monday, July 18th at 9 p.m. Eastern Time on VH1 with two back-to-back episodes. Temi, you've absolutely enjoyed our conversation today. Thank you so much for talking with us right here and so excited to tune in. Thank you for having me. Appreciate you.